themselves from the dreams to dangle above their heads. He nods politely to Aragog. Well, thank you. The world doesn't go. Go? I think not. My sons and daughters do not harm Hagrid on my command. But I cannot deny them fresh meat when it wanders so willingly into our midst. Goodbye, friend of Hagrid. Do we panic now? Happy swoop, the lantern. Yeah. And again. He drops it. They pull out their wands. Oh, his spells. But it's not powerful enough for all of them. Where's the money when you need her? The spiders close in. It's the Fort Anglia. It stops and the doors fly open. Oh. Fang jumps into the back seat, Ron into the front. Ron, exit the dives from the passenger seat as the spiders attack. Spiders, Ron backs the car out to run the tree roots and back along the narrow tunnel. The car hurtles backwards out of the entrance and flies through the air. The car hits the ground and comes to a halt, dislodging the last spider. Club are out of there. The spider grabs Ron through the open window. Harry points his wand. Spider was hurtled backwards. Ron looks at Harry with relief. Thanks for that. Direction. Harry's eyes suddenly open wide as he looks through the cracked windscreen. Hundreds of huge spiders appear from amongst the shadowy trees and move towards the car, ready to attack again. Yes, now! Ron sparks the car and puts it into reverse. Accelerates. The spiders scuttle close behind the car as it jolts away between the trees. The floor of the forest is a seething mass of spiders. And he turns to Ron in desperation. Ron grabs the gear stick. The spiders lurk in the trees, ready to jump on the car. Spiders loom ahead of them. They both heave on the gear stick. The car rises into the air, smashing into a branch and scattering spiders. Steadying itself, the car flies high over the tops of the tall trees. It zooms over the forest and lands heavily on the grass beside Hagrid's cottage. They stagger out. and drives away past Hagrid's cottage before disappearing amongst the trees at the edge of the dark forest. I mean, what was the point of sending us in there? What have we found out? We know one thing. Hagrid never opened the Chamber of Secrets. He was innocent. <laughs> 